Executives overseeing the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear plant want to restart reactors at another plant they own. The TEPCO officials want permission to resume operations at the reactors in Kashiwazaki, Niigata Prefecture, but they face stiff opposition. All but two reactors in Japan remain offline. Following the 2011 accident at the Fukushima plant, reactors meet new safety standards that go into effect this month before they can go back into operation. Niigata Governor Hirohiko Izumida is opposed to the plan by the Tokyo Electric Power Company. He says that there can be no discussion about uh, restarting the plan until the Fukushima accident is thoroughly investigated. TEPCO's board of directors decided to apply for government screening of the Kashiwazaki plant as soon as the new guidelines take effect. We'd like to explain to the residents why we want to make our application to the government as soon as possible. TEPCO raised electricity fees last year to cover the growing cost of fuel for its thermal power plants, but it continues to struggle with a huge deficit. TEPCO posted more than $6.8 billion in losses for the year through March. The firm must return to the black by March next year in order to receive taxpayer money and bank loans to rebuild its finances. It says by operating just one reactor, it can cut fuel costs by about $10 million a month.